G'day Lions fans, here's your weekly update. Well firstly, thanks to everyone who got on board our superhero round theme when we took on Carlton here at the Gabba on Saturday. The win against the Blues was the first time we've gone back to back since 2015 and against Hawthorne on Saturday in Launceston, we'll be aiming for three in a row. In the win against the Blues, Eric Hipwood kicked a career high of six goals. Stain Beams received a maximum of 10 votes from the AFL Coaches Association for his performance, where he had 40 disposals. In good news, in both the AFL and NEFL games, no new injuries were recorded. But disappointing news for Brisbane Lions defender Matty Eagles, who will miss the rest of the 2018 AFL season due to an ongoing abdominal groin injury. This will require surgery after Lions medical staff exhausted every non-surgical option of rehabilitation. Meanwhile, Harris Andrews has been cleared to restart training under concussion protocols and this morning took part in some training drills and did a couple of laps of the Gabba Oval. The team will be departing Brisbane for Tasmania on Friday morning and will host an open training session at the University of Tasmania Stadium in Launceston at 3.15. All the details will be on the website, but it will be great for any of our Tassie fans to come down and join us. Our Neufel side will be looking to bounce back after their close loss to the Southport Sharks on the weekend when they take on the University of Sydney team at Blacktown Sports Arena at 12 o'clock this Saturday. For any Lions fans in Sydney, make sure you go ahead to the game at 12 o'clock and cheer on our boys. And our Lions AFLW side will be looking for a clean sweep of the competition when they take on the Gold Coast in their final Winter Series match this weekend at Metricon Stadium. AFLW Lions members will have free entry to the game which starts at 4.40pm. So any Lions AFLW supporters jump on the M1 and head down to support the girls at Metricon Stadium. Well that's all we've got time for but make sure you head to lions.com.au on Thursday for the important team news announcements. Go Lions!